the UCI Women's World Tour stays in China for the final race of the 2023 season, the Tour of Guangxi. In the autonomous region bordering Vietnam, the riders are presented with an interesting course that is mostly flat, but the two climbs in the second half of the race could interest attacking riders. However, history learns that the Tour of Guangxi is mostly a battle between sprinters. Guangxi can be a bit of a different one. Um, I've raced it two times before, um, and sometimes it finishes in a bigger bunch sprint, sometimes a smaller one. Uh, so it really just depends how hard the two climbs are ridden. And we have a team here for both options, really. It's, um, it's a long, long day on the bike, and uh, yeah, quite, um, quite flat until the climb uh, further into the race. And I think, yeah. A bunch sprint is expected, but yeah, you got the climb to to play it out for the people who want to to test the legs and see if they can anticipate the bunch sprint. But yeah, it's a lot of uh, sprinter teams here, and uh, I think in this case, it's a big chance for a sprint. And the riders are off for the final 144.6 kilometers of the 2023 UCI Women's World Tour season. Then two riders break away from the peloton, Lu Xingying of the Chinese national team and Gulnas Katnuseva of Li Ning Star Ladies team. The two ride well together and stay ahead of the bunch and get over two minutes from the peloton. Then on the first QOM it is Katnuseva who attacks Li Xingying and goes solo for the full QOM points. She goes over the top and tries to stay away solo, but soon a Chinese rider catches her and there are two again in the front. But on the second climb of the day, the two riders are caught and there is a fight for the last QOM point, where Victory Gulman wins the points ahead of Anuska Koster and Tamara Dronova. Now the peloton is preparing themselves for yet another sprint as predicted. And when they go into the final corner, the pack is really tight together. It is rider against rider and all the way to the left. It is Daria Pikulik who is slowly pulling away and has the strongest legs. So it is Daria Pikulik who wins the final race of the 2023 UCI Women's World Tour season, the Tour of Guangxi. After winning the first stage on the UCI Women's World Tour calendar in Tour Down Under, Daria Pikulik also wins the final one in the Tour of Guangxi. Chiara Consoni sprints to second ahead of Mia Griffin. Qin Tang is the best Chinese rider in fifth place. With all the UCI Women's World Tour races done, this is what the final ranking looks like. Demi Vollering wins her first ever UCI Women's World Tour with a big margin over her teammates Lotte Kopecki with second and Marlon Reuser in third. Behind the whole SD Works podium, Kasia Nibiadoma is fourth. Sherine van Androoy wins the 2023 UCI Women's World Tour Young Rider classification. Her teammate Gaia Realini takes second place and Maika van der Duin completes the final podium. So far for an amazing season of racing in the UCI Women's World Tour.